Welcome back to the Grand Solar Minimum Channel. Today is Tuesday, September 10th, 2019. Taking a look at our space weather here at the Space Weather Station, our solar wind speeds are coming in at 504.6 with a density of 0.8. Our sun is blank once again, looking at day seven in a row now without sunspots. That's a total of 176 days without sunspots in 2019. Our KP and the C is coming in at a 1 and our 24 hour max is sitting at a 3. Right now the TCI temperature reading is coming in at 3.96 so it has not changed from what we reported last night. And looking at the SDO in motion we do not have a sunspot, no corona holes, nothing. The sun is quiet and we expect low solar activity for quite some time here. Let's take a look at our national forecast. We got showers and thunderstorms just about everywhere you can look. Uh, nothing too severe, only in the middle of the country. Nebraska, South Dakota, you guys have the strongest chances for severe weather. Uh, Iowa, Wisconsin, and Michigan, you're getting ready to endure some heavy rain showers for the next several hours. The rest of the United States has a chance for a pop-up thunderstorm. Nothing too severe, but again, everyone seems to have a fair chance today as some scattered showers and rain. And let's take another quick look at our next system that could potentially affect the United States by September 20th. We showed yesterday on our show, and we were looking at some time around um, the 18th on landfall, this thing has been pushed back a little bit. Now we're looking at landfall closer to the 21st of September. Again, this storm is staying on the forecast. Uh, usually we lose these things, they disappear just magically after a couple of days. But this storm continues to reappear in the models as we get closer to this time of the month. So we expect some kind of a landfall of something. Again, we're too far out. This is the 20th, the 21st, and 22nd. So it's, this could be just a tropical depression or just a regular rainstorm. But if it is a hurricane, it's good to know now. This thing is a decent sized storm. We're talking Cat 2, Cat 3, still a dangerous hurricane. Hopefully it's not a repeat of what we had in the Bahamas before it gets to the mainland. But as you see, we have landfall, and then just like last night, the track has not changed. It's going up the east coast, but this time the heavier rain of this will be felt through the entire east coast, according to this model. Not looking good, folks. So we might end September with a bang, that's for sure. And if you guys are paying attention here as I'm streaming out here closer towards the end, uh, September 25th, nice little cold front making its way, trying to penetrate the United States. Snow showers just barely north of us here in upstate New York and across the Great Lakes. You see the snow showers developing in Canada already. So that's stuff that we will keep our eyes on, folks. That's going to do it for us today. Tune in on Wednesday night for our live show at 9 p.m. Eastern Time. Until then, we will talk soon, guys. Take care.